how's it going guys welcome to double o heaven now apologies it's been a while uh, within the last two weeks i've actually started a new job and me and my fiance have also been starting our own catering business as well so yeah it's been kind of full on from both sides so uh i've only been restricted to doing a bit of bargain hunting online recently but i have managed to pick myself up a couple of bargains now the first one i'll show you um these two I got from the same seller, but the first one. Um, now, I've not seen this brand in the shops much. Scenics. Um, now, I've had a look online, and on Amazon, these go for £20 upwards. Uh, this one I managed to get for £14, so I'll save myself a few quid on it. But uh, let's get it out of the box and have a little butch at it. Now, I, when I bid it on it, I also had a look online to see the pictures of it and to uh, see how it would look. And I was actually quite pleased with it. And this one's the um, Village Hall School. And um, it's actually a really nice model, and there's a resin model as well. So for £14, you know, it's, if this would have been a Backman range, this would have been like £40 plus. But, um, yeah, here we go. Yeah, this is a yeah, a really nice model, and um, you know, for fourteen pounds, yeah, I'm well happy with that. So let's just pump it up in here for a moment. In the same cellar was um, a British Rail corridor coach from um, Mainline, and uh, this was only eight pounds. And uh, it's in really good condition, although it does look like it's had um, it's had a new wheel put on. I'll show you what I mean. But um, it's all in very nice condition. But if you look just here, that's a new wheel being put on there. But hey, I don't mind as long as it all works fine. Um, yeah, and that looks like it's been, you know. Good job done on that. So yeah, more than happy with that one. And Jeff for eight pound, and the other one fourteen pounds. Uh, a bit of saving on the postage as well. Yeah, that was well worth, well worth looking into. Now um, the other one I got was um, now I got all three of these for just twenty one pounds, and these are the old Triang British Rail coaches. So I got a composite brake coach there and a couple of the others there now when I first got these these were really these were really um sort of dusty and dirty so I didn't even bother trying them on the track um so yeah I'll give them a little clean up and um the, the wheels needed a bit of an oil on them as well because they were um they were sort of very very stiff and um they still are a little bit but uh, they were a lot better than what they were but um, maybe they could do with a little bit more of a clean up but um, yeah, for £21 in total, all three coaches there, guys, um, yeah, that's not a bad bargain at all. And the other ones that I've got, now these are only about £7 something. Now, these are Trix coaches. And the couplings on these are slightly different, but they're easily converted are just screws there which you can uh, unscrew take off and you know put the other ones on as well so um yeah for seven pounds you know these are nice looking trucks i got three of those so yeah so yeah overall guys you know uh, i've not had too much time to, you know look for stuff and spend too much but um yeah i'm quite happy with the bargains that i've got there so i managed to update the rolling stock and also my soldering iron came as well and um, so yeah keep tuned because the black five restoration will be coming up next but um, yeah anyway guys let's, um, let's have a look at these on the track and um, let's see which one of my British rail trains can pull on the best and we'll try them with all four now I've tried the Triang ones with my Princess Vicky my Triang Vicky and uh, she actually pulled them fine no worries so um, Let's stick it with a fourth one on there. This one it is a bit slightly longer than the other ones. By about uh, 
probably by about a good centimetre and a half. But um, it's not a problem. We'll uh, we'll stick it on with these and see if, see how she gets on pulling all four. We'll also stick the school on the layout as well and see if we can find a nice spot for that. I've got a rough idea where that's going to go, so we'll stick that on and see if we can find a nice spot for it. Right, okay, let's try this. Now, uh, this corridor coach is uh, it's quite a bit heavier than the other three, but we'll do it anyway with all four. So she's pulling a fairly good train there. Let's power her up. So far, so good. Oh, yep, yeah, we're looking good there. Much struggle up the incline here, we might have to help her out. Oh my god, no, straight, go on. Oh, yep, yeah, struggling a bit, go on. There she goes. I'm struggling on the points there, go on, look. Yep, yeah, that's managing. We'll bring around one more time and then we'll try the prairie. We should handle it better that time. Go on. Just gonna hit the point again. No, no, no. Okay. One more time, I think. Here we go. Well, pretty successful. But we don't want to burn her out. So let's uh, try the prairie. Alright. Okay. Let's see how the old prairie gets on. Quite well. He's still quite noisy, by the way, guys. Mm, he's handled that okay. Spinning a bit, struggles there. Mm, there he goes. Struggling there. Help me there. Yeah. We'll stop them up there. Well, they pulled them, but that coach is pretty heavy, I must admit. I mean, that incline ain't much, but that's enough to slow them down. I mean, I do need to level the layout up a little bit. As you see, I've got the school over here. I need to put some walls around it because we can't have the kids playing out here near a train track, can we? And that just wouldn't be wouldn't be safe at all. But uh, yeah, the layout's coming on up in this uh, sort of section now. I need to get some pathways and some proper roads in. But here uh, yeah, we've got a a chippy in here. I need to paint the model shop still. There's my old butchers. Take the shape as well. I redid the uh, stone on the uh, colon stage as well. I put the uh, the grey stone brick on, which uh, looks quite a bit better now. If he's having a drink. But yeah, that's nice to actually have some uh, British Rail coaches now. I think you guys probably found it quite funny that I had uh, <laughs> British Rail trains try to pull LMER coaches. <laughs> so yeah, I do. I did realise I had to update the rolling stock. But yeah, anyway guys, that's all for me for now. Have a banging day. I'll see you all soon.